everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Kaylee and this is my very first video. I've never um, had a YouTube channel before so this is going to be a whole lot of fun. Um, if you enjoy grocery hauls, cook with me, clean with me type videos, that's what I plan on posting here. Um, I am a stay-at-home mom to three children and you know, we're a family of five. Um, me and my husband and our five-year-old daughter, Raya. We have a 19-month-old son named Vinny. We have a three-month-old daughter named Mila. So today for our first video, I am going to be sharing some grocery hauls. Uh, well, a Sam's Club haul today. We went to Sam's Club, Kroger, and the Dollar Tree today. Um, we were able to get out without the children today, which doesn't happen very often. So we got out and took advantage of it today. Today, in this video, I'm going to be sharing the Sam's Club haul. And here in just a minute, I'm going to be sharing the Dollar Tree haul because we didn't get a whole lot there. So, I mean, we don't go to the Dollar Tree a whole lot, but I need to start going there more often because you can get some really, really great things there for a dollar. Um, so if you have a Dollar Tree in your area, you should totally check it out. Later in this video... I will have our Sam's Club haul in this video and then our Kroger haul I will have in a later a video later this week. Like I said, we are a family of five. My husband's name is Tyler. He works outside of the home for a local carpet cleaning company. I stay home. I uh, worked for a local grocery store chain for 12 years and after I had our son we just decided to that it would be best for me to stay home with the kids and then we have our daughter and so now I am dabbling in the video creator world so I'm very new so please be nice <laughs> but any tips would be greatly appreciated so sorry if this is a little bit awkward I'm still trying to get my flow of things so um, please be kind to me um, anyway let's dive right in here to the Dollar Tree haul. We have a lot of Dollar Trees around our area. There's probably six of them um, and I have never been to this one. We went to the one closest to the um, the Kroger store that we were going to and it was humongous. The biggest one that I think we probably have around here. Um, so I wanted to, we were kind of on a little bit of a time crunch um, so I didn't get to do a whole lot of looking, but we'll definitely be going back to that one. Um, but we got these, we have gotten these light bulbs before. Um, the LED, that's probably backwards. Um, sorry about that. Uh, the LED 120 volt, 100 watt light bulbs. This is 1500 lumens. I don't know if you can see that, it's 1500 lumens. Um, with super bright light bulbs and they are a dollar. Yes, they're only single packs, but these are really expensive kinds of light bulbs if you go to the Kroger or the hardware store or whatever, buy them. They are very, very expensive and those are a dollar and they work really, really well. Um, these, on the other hand, we got a bunch of batteries. I think we got one, two, three, four, five, six. I have a baby swing that takes C batteries and I hate spending, you know, $10 on big packs of batteries so these come in a pack of two they are again it's gonna be backwards I'm so sorry um, two C batteries they're a dollar they don't work the greatest but they will do um, we also got a bunch of packs of the triple A batteries same brand yeah, I mean it says right there it's for low drain devices they don't last very long but they'll work our older daughter, Raya, she's five. She got a Barbie for Christmas, which I never really played with Barbies. I didn't play with Barbies a whole lot when I was little, so I didn't think to get her um, anything like that for Christmas, but somebody did. One of our family members got her a Barbie and she has been loving it. So we don't have a whole lot of Barbie things. So I told her I would go to the dollar store. She's at her grandma's house spending the night. So I told her I would look for some clothes. We don't have any Barbie clothes. We don't have any accessories. We don't have any anything. So I told her I'd go to the dollar store and look and they actually had 
quite a few. I got the only three options they had as far as clothing goes. They had this little dress, sorry for the glare. That cute little party dress. They all had all dresses. They didn't have any outfits. Um, There's a gold one with the little black, black belt around it. I think that it'll be really easy for her to change the clothes. You know how difficult the clothes always are. This one kind of looks like a princess dress. I don't know, like maybe Rapunzel, Rapunzel's dress. It's got the blue with the yellow. And then this purple, I don't know if you can see that, if it's coming through on the camera, but it's got these silver detailing. It's really pretty. Um, those are all the same brand. Fashion Doll, Pompeii Mode, Pompeii Mode. So we got those, and then they did have one, they had a whole bunch of these Barbies. They had like just a ton of them. I'm assuming leftover from Christmas. I don't know, but they were all wearing different, um, different dresses. Same Barbie doll. They all had a whole bunch. They had a whole bunch of different dolls, but these are a dollar. I mean, you cannot beat that. It comes with a little necklace. What is that? A hair, a hairbrush, a purse, and a pair of shoes. I don't know. I can't tell if she's already wearing a pair of shoes, but I picked out this light blue because my daughter, like most five-year-olds right now, is obsessed with Frozen, loves Frozen, walks around here pretending like she has ice powers like Elsa. Oh my goodness. Anyone, can anyone relate? Let me know in the comments. Is your little ones obsessed with Frozen like mine is? So I bought, got this, I went for this light, bl light blue dress. She loves light blue right now. It was pink and purple. Went for the light blue. I mean, when you when you look really closely at it, you can tell this is a dollar store Barbie. You can see all of the edging, but I mean, it's a dollar. Can't complain. So there she is. And then I also got her this accessory pack. They didn't have, I mean, they had a couple different ones of these, but they didn't have a ton to choose from. I don't know if it's just because it's after Christmas whatever like I said I couldn't really I didn't have a whole lot of time to just look around um but it has this little um wristlet like clutch wallet thing it's blue orange it's blue orange oh my goodness these orange shoes this is a hair clip more shoes I believe that is a purse a purple purse and these orange shoes so I thought those were cute it would go good with the Barbie she has and then this Barbie I just got her so I hope she I think she'll like that um and then for my son we got him a bunch of these both of my kids I feel like are at the age we got them a lot of their Christmas stuff from the dollar store our older daughter loves crafts and stuff like that they have a whole kinds of stuff like that um and then our son is really into these little little vehicles um, he has two other ones of these. Um, I think he has like an olive green colored one and a red one. He loves just riding these around. He likes to ride them on my head and stuff. So he thinks it's funny. And then, you know, he gets all ticklish when I run it across his head. So he likes those. I couldn't leave him out. Um, and then we, the last couple of things we got, I have been needing like a new little scrubber thing for our um bathroom uh not for the toilet but for the um for like the sink and the tub and stuff like that and I thought this would do a really good job it's the scrub buddies brand scrub buddies um I don't know how good they are I don't know how long they're gonna last but figured we'd give it a try and the last thing we got from the Dollar Tree is this right here just a little scrubber. Um, I've needed something like this for shoes. I mean, we have we have a swing set in our backyard with all the rain and stuff. It hasn't been too, too cold here. We've had a couple of cold days, but um, Raya, our five-year-old, um, she has some friends that live right next door to us, and they are outside constantly playing, which I'm not complaining about, but she likes to play in the mud. And with it's been rainy and nasty and... We have a swing set underneath the swing set is all dirt so when it rains it gets really muddy our backyard stays kind of swampy so needed a scrub brush for clothes for we've got three kids 
our little boy gets, he has cups leak, we needed a scrub brush for clothes, carpet, shoes, things like that. So I think that is everything that I got from the Dollar Tree. Next, we're gonna just jump right into the Sam's Club haul. We go to Sam's, I mean, Sam, there's a Sam's Club not even five minutes from our house, but we don't go there super often. We usually go there for more um, snack type things, uh, drinks, things like that. So we just went like two weeks ago. There was just a couple of things. We ran out of drinks, so we knew we needed to go and get, go there and get drinks. You get so much of a better deal there. Um, if I can, I'm still very new to the whole editing process and things like that. I will try to pop up prices. I know I like to see prices of things when I watch these kinds of videos. This, our house is, um, I mean, you'll see in the Sam's Club video, our kitchen is not huge. We don't have a big table. I mean, we live in a 900 square foot house. Um, it's not huge. So, I mean, you'll see in future videos, we'll film clean with me type videos. Um, you know, with three kids and trying to keep things clean. I mean, we do a lot of cleaning with it. We, I mean, we eat most of our meals here, so there's always dishes and fun, fun stuff to do like that. Um, so, I mean, you'll see, I don't have a big table. So when filming these grocery hauls, I kind of had to split up some of it and that's fine, especially the Sam's Club haul. I did not have to split up today. It was not very big. We got a couple of snacky type things and mostly drinks. Like I said, I will try to pop up prices. I feel like I'm getting a little bit repetitive. Anywho, yes, we have a five-year-old daughter. Her name is Soraya. We call her Raya. We have a 19-month-old son. His name is Vincent. We call him Vinny or Ben. We have a three-month-old daughter named Mila. And yeah, we're just doing our thing. I'm sure you'll hear me saying the boys we only have one boy, but three to four days a week, I have my nephew who's five months younger than my son. He's here with us hanging out. So most of the time I have three children here under the age of two. I mean, it it's very, very fun, but yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy this channel. Please leave me some comments below, things you might wanna see. I plan on, like I said, filming grocery hauls, clean with me hauls, organizing. I mean, our bedroom needs organized, my daughter's room. I mean, we just kind of are coming out of Christmas, so it's time to, you know, declutter, um, purge some of these toys that we have. I mean, we have an entire basement as our playroom. And I mean, I we've never purged our toys before since my daughter was little. We have so many toys and I will be filming us going through my daughter's room. She is in need of a room makeover. We'll be doing that. Um, we, myself and my husband are in need of a major room makeover. I'll be filming that. I mean, those are the kind of things that you can expect to see. I've got lots of ideas as far as that goes. Um, it's just gonna be getting there. Uh, I am starting Weight Watchers. You'll hear me talk about that a little bit in the hauls that I filmed. Um, so there will be some, you know, cooking videos, recipe videos. Um, so I can always have those linked in the description below. I hope you guys enjoy the Sam's Club haul. Sorry, I'm getting a little long-winded. I just wanted to, to introduce myself, tell you a little bit about me and our family. I don't know how much my children and my husband are gonna be in these videos. I'm sure they're gonna show up in some of these videos. And maybe we'll start doing vlogs, who knows. But anyway, I will stop talking. Let's get into the Sam's Club haul. So this is our, um, what, what we got at Sam's Club. Um, we didn't get a whole lot this time. Usually we get a lot more, but we just went like two weeks ago and this was just the stuff that we needed. Um, don't mind this over here. We homeschool our five-year-old um, through an online program and we don't have a very big house. So. <clears throat> so first, let's start back here. We got some 
pirate's booty. We haven't bought this before. Um, so, but the kids liked the puffed popcorn stuff. So we're gonna try that. We got some sun chips, the garden salsa, um, the harvest cheddar, those are for me. Um, we've got hot sauce. My husband likes to, we have a small, we usually we buy these big things of ranch. Um, we have a small container of ranch that we bought and he likes to, um, when it gets like a quarter of the way gone, he likes to put hot sauce in it and then we shake it up and he's got like hot ranch. Um, we got some of our gum. We did get some chicken breast. A lot of this will be going into the freezer. That was 15, 59, but I think there's how many pounds in here? Almost five pounds, four and a half pounds of chicken. Um, my husband picked that out. We needed some more cooking spray. This is also for my husband. It's his favorite. We are in the, uh, we live in Ohio in the Cincinnati area. So if you are not from around here, Skyline Chili on hot dogs, as you can see right there. It's delicious. This is also something my husband picked up. The broccoli cheese raw stuffed chicken breast. It's breaded. I don't know. We've never gotten that before. Um, I think I already showed you the ranch. We go through ranch like crazy in here. By we, I mean my husband and our oldest daughter. Um, we also sell these veggie straw, like the veggie straw brand of the sour cream and onion puffs. And then I picked out this um, diet green tea. And my husband got the regular green tea. And then we also got the Gold Peak Sweet Tea. And that is everything that we got from Sam's Club. I forgot to mention on this chicken, they are, um, they do have, it was folded in half, and they do have two fillets per little pouch, and they are, so we'll I'll probably cook one of these on Monday and then um, probably freeze the other two. I'll put this one in our fridge and cook one. And then it says it's best by the eighth. And today is, I think the second or third, something like that, I'm not sure. But it says it's good till the eighth. So I'll probably put one in the fridge. We'll probably cook one on Monday or so. Maybe I'll freeze three of them. So, but that is, everything that we got at Sam's Club. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed the Dollar Tree and Sam's Club haul. Stay tuned. Over the next couple days, I will have our Kroger grocery haul. It's definitely a bigger one. And then I am going to try to film a book with me kind of video tomorrow. We will see how that goes. It's a um, pasta sauce kind of recipe. It's one of my favorites. It's super Weight Watchers friendly. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe down below, hit the bell so that you get notified when I post videos. I plan on posting hopefully at least two, maybe three videos a week, just depending on what we've got going on. But uh, look for you in the next one. Bye.